Now, here are just a few things you could do if you wanted to practice your executive functioning. But time doesn't permit me to go into those. I want to focus on these. There are several ways you would alter the point of performance to help somebody with ADHD or any other executive disorder. Number one, remember, mental information is not guiding behavior. The working memory system is deficient. So what's the solution? Put the information back in the environment where it originated. The word is externalize, as Vygotsky implied. You are more under the control of things in your sensory fields, so get the information back out there. I need you to externalize time, because the internal clock is broken, using timers, clocks, counters, and other timing mechanisms. We need to break lengthy tasks into very small quotas, self-pacing, so that the individual doesn't have to cross-temporally organize or sustain. We are going to break the goal into smaller chunks and have the individual do smaller chunks at a time. We must use external motivators rather than relying on internal motivation. That's what token systems do, points, privileges, money, all of those sorts of things. External motivators. And then we must make problem solving manual rather than mental because they can't hold the pieces in mind in order to manipulate them to solve the problem. Finally, we need to remember that the executive system is a limited resource system and make sure that we do not defeat the system by demanding executive functioning for too long at a time. There are various ways of dealing with that fuel tank. I'll just list a few as I conclude here. If you want to boost your executive functioning, these are the things that will help you with your self-control. Notice they involve breaking tasks into smaller units, using external reinforcement, using statements of self-efficacy and encouragement, using brief periods of relaxation in which you give the executive system a break, visualizing your goals and your consequences, and routine physical exercise improves the executive system and expands the fuel tank. Finally, the entire fuel tank is based on blood glucose in the frontal lobe. So if you have protracted work to do that is effortful, like taking a high stakes exam or doing homework, you better be sipping on some lemonade or a sports drink or something that creates a low infusion of blood glu glucose into that frontal lobe because that is the basis for all of that resource pool.